Good evening. Welcome to the opening of uh, Hungarian Film Week, right? best film prize in Montreal Film Festival. The Film Week will take place in Tel Aviv, Haifa and Jerusalem Cinematex in the, during the next week. And you are welcome to come to our films as well. I am honored to invite to the stage Ambassador of Hungary, the Venti Bank. Shalom Khaverim. Roma Hölgyeknek, jó estét kívánok az uraknak. Dear friends of Hungary, and last but not least, dear movie fans. My name is Levente Benke, I'm the ambassador of Hungary and Israel, and it is my distinct pleasure to welcome you all at the Hungarian Film Festival we are organizing within the framework of the Hungarian Cultural Year in Israel in 2019. I feel truly blessed to represent my country in Israel at a time when the bonds between Hungary and Israel are stronger than ever. When we speak about such bonds, we tend to think about politics and diplomacy first. And indeed, we cannot complain in this regard. Just as the recent opening of the Hungarian Embassy Trade Office in Jerusalem demonstrated, we can proudly declare that Hungary is probably Israel's best friend in Europe. Politics is important, but I am convinced that it is the human bonds between our peoples that are always the backbone of any political relationship. Culture opens hearts and minds, and it is the real, and it is the real flag bearer of diplomacy. And here too, we have a lot to be proud of. This year, we are running the first ever Hungarian Culture Year in Israel, with dozens of programs in dance, opera, gastronomy, fine arts, and street festivals showcasing the best and the brightest of Hungary we have on offer to the people of Israel. Culture Year is meant to commemorate the 30th anniversary of the re-establishment of diplomatic relations between Hungary and Israel. Three decades during which Hungarian cinema has also undergone a thorough transformation after the fall of communism, gaining a prominent place for itself on the map of international cinema. Building on a heritage of giants like Michael Kert uh, Mihai Kertész, also known as Michael Curtiz, or Sándor Korda, better known globally as Sir Alexander Korda, the success of Hungarian cinema is rolling on, with prizes in Berlin and Cannes, as well as two Oscars recently. The selected movies for the Hungarian Film Week will let the Israeli audience taste a variety of genres, from, both from recent productions as well as classical pieces of Hungarian cinema, appealing to all ages and to all backgrounds. And to an audience going beyond Tel Aviv, as we are having parallel screenings both in Jerusalem and in Haifa. This is made possible due to the generous help provided by the Hungarian Media Council, whose board member, Mr. Tomás Korolik, is here with us tonight, as well as with the support of the Hungarian Academy of Arts represented here tonight by Secretary General Tamás Kucsara. The classical masterpieces were digitalized by the Hungarian National Film Fund, also with the support of the Hungarian Academy of Arts. Last but not least, our embassy would like to thank our professional Israeli partners, Cinematech, for the excellent cooperation in organizing the Hungarian Film Week. I hope you can all come back tomorrow evening to Cinematech, as I can wholeheartedly recommend the thriller on schedule. As ambassador to Tel Aviv, one of my personal favorites is the movie titled The Ambassador to Bern, a movie that carries the viewer back in history, narrating a real-life, nail-biting hostage drama that took place shortly after the 1956 Hungarian Revolution at the Hungarian <laughs> Embassy in Switzerland. Tuesday, you will have a glimpse of Belle Epoque Budapest and its high society with the movie Demimond, a thriller centered around a famous and mysterious murder case right before the outbreak of World War I. Speaking of which, it is my distinct pleasure to announce that on the occasion of the Hungarian Film Week, the broadcasting rights of both the Ambassador to Bern and Demimond, along with the third movie, will be offered free of charge.
to Khan, the Israeli Public Broadcasting Corporation. The gratitude goes to the producer, Mr. Tamás Lajos, also here with us today, as well as to the Hungarian Media Council. Returning to our schedule this week, on Wednesday you can certainly not miss the favorite animation movie of many Hungarians, Cat City, or Macska Fogok, which became a cultic piece for the entire, the entire generation. On Friday afternoon, a stimulating roundtable is planned in cooperation with the Hungarian Mohoinad University of Art, the Batsala Academy of Jerusalem, and the Holon Institute of Technology. The event, with screenings by each institute and the roundtable discussion, will present different approaches of animation. Saturday will feature the epic drama El Dorado, narrating, the di narrating dilemmas unlikely everyday heroes in Central Europe had to face with the entire 20th century coming crashing down on their families. And last but not least, Sunday will be dedicated to illustrious Hungarian short animation films, among them the Academy Award winner, Fly, with the possibility to meet and talk with the filmmakers after the screen. Before all that happens, however, we have an opening movie tonight, Curtis, a drama presenting the adventurous life of the famous Hungarian-born Hollywood director, Mihai Kertész or Marco Curtis, who won the Oscar for his epic movie in difficult historical times. We are speaking about Casablanca, of course. We are fortunate enough to have the producer as well as the actor for the lead character amongst us here tonight. Thank you for being here, Ms. Claudia Schumegi and Mr. Ferenc Lengyel. Since they are here, <laughs> since they are here, and I certainly do not wish to be a spoiler, uh, all that is left for me uh, before the movie starts uh, is to ask, uh, ask both of them to join me on the stage and say a few sentences about Curtis. I wish all of you a wonderful evening, and uh, we are looking forward to meeting you during the rest of the week, and certainly during the rest of the Hungarian Culture Year in Israel, uh, which, please bear in mind, will last as long as until late October. Thank you very much for your attention, and please welcome Ms. Claudia Schumegi and Mr. Ferenc Lenga. Thank you, Elisa, and thank you for the embassy. Uh, thank you to the embassy for the invitation tonight. And uh, I would like to say that it's a great honor to be here and be in the opening film of the Hungarian Film Week. And uh, first of all, I would like to ask how many of you are speaking or understanding Hungarian? Raise your hands, please. Quite a lot. So, I would like to ask our lead actor, I would like to introduce and ask our lead actor, Ferenc Lengyel, Mr. Curtis, to say some kind words to you in Hungarian. Shalom. <laughs> <laughs> It was a surprise for me too. So um, we are very happy to be here and thank you for coming. And I hope you're going to have a great time watching our movie. Thank you for the National Media Fund supporting our first feature film. Actually, I'm representing my husband, the director of the film, Tamás Ivan Tobolanski, who is unfortunately he can't be here tonight because he is representing the film in another film festival in uh, Italy, where he actually won the Best Director Prize just in this him. And um, actually, I was asked to say a few words about Curtis, and I don't want to be a spoiler neither. So um, there's a list in our, so to say, press kit, the frequently asked questions. And as far as I know, there's not going to be a Q&A after this meeting. So I chose one question from this um, frequently asked questions list. Um, and that one is why we chose Michael Curtis. 
and uh, how was the making of the movie? Was it um, very frightening or scary for a first-time filmmaker to choose a topic so deep or risky as Casablanca? Um, and I wanted to answer it, that we chose uh, Kathy's Mihai and the story of Casablanca because uh, he was one of the most famous Hungarian directors ever lived. And uh, as one of his most famous fans says, he is the greatest director you've never heard of. If uh, in Hungary we say the name Curtis, everyone think, is thinking about a famous rap singer, a good friend of Michael, another rap singer, and we decided to change this thing in Hungary. So we want to honor, we wanted to honor to his legacy with this movie. And actually he made more than 160 films under the aegis of Warner Brothers Studios, among them Casablanca, for which he won the Academy Award. And um, I would like to ask Ferry to say a few words about how was how was it to portray a director as famous as he was. <coughs> Very strong. <laughs> <laughs> he stayed he stayed in this Curtis character, I think. So I don't want to take your time any longer. Thank you very much again for being here, and I wish you a pleasant time. Mike, just a second, please. Have you considered my suggestion? I won't kill a German in my film. Even those assholes would shit their pants if I did that. We're on the same boat, Mike. And Europe is sinking. Why don't we help each other put on the life vest? I understand you were a soldier. You fought in the Great War. What happened since then? 